The nation is preparing for a possible opposition from Japan to South Korea's WTO Director General candidate. Meanwhile, a high-ranking Seoul official harshly criticized Tokyo for dismissing the notion, the notion rather, of an expanded G7 summit. Yoon Jung-min has the full story. Though there has been no official response from Japan, South Korean officials are bracing themselves for a possible opposition to Seoul's trade minister, Yoon Myung-hee, running for the World Trade Organization Director General post. This comes amid the ongoing trade spat between Seoul and Tokyo, which has rumbled on for almost a year. Sources say Tokyo could be unwilling to support Yu, as she has been leading Seoul's WTO complaint against Japan's expert curves on South Korea. As part of the director general election process, the WTO general council has to narrow down the field of candidates until a unanimous consensus around one is reached. But Seoul is reportedly preparing for the possibility of Tokyo creating an unfavorable sentiment against a South Korean candidate. At a media briefing Monday, Japan's chief cabinet secretary Yoshihide Suga said that it is crucial to maintain the current G7 framework. This follows as U.S. President Donald Trump earlier proposed increasing the number of G7 members, including South Korea, along with Russia, India and Australia. Citing high-ranking government officials, Kyoto News Agency reported that Tokyo has told the White House that South Korea is not in lockstep with G7 members on China and issues with North Korea. In response, a senior official at Seoul's top office harshly criticized Japan on Monday, saying such an act is, quote, shameless. The official reportedly added that the international community would be well aware of Japan's attitude and so shouldn't have too great of an impact. The same official reportedly criticized Tokyo for harming its neighbor without any sense of regret. Yoon Jung-min, Arirang News.